Inspector MD sir and all my senior colleagues present here, I am going to present uh, a very very rare complication of rhinosinusitis which we came across in our hospital. Actually, uh, this is the first case of orbital cellulitis which I came across in my whole ENT career. A 47 years male presented with history of high grade fever, persistent headache and facial pain and proptosis of right ear, right eye at Railway Hospital KGP in last week of February 2014. Uh, he was a staff of medical department as a Safai wala and uh, <coughs> after the initial management the patient was referred to Central Hospital Garden Ridge. He was admitted to Central Hospital GRC in medical department and Subsequently, he was referred to uh, ENT department. On history, the patient was found to have allergic rhinitis with watery discharge from nose and excessive sneezing for last eight years duration and nasal block for last six months. There was history of bronchial asthma. The patient was non-diabetic, normotensive. There was no history of any other significant illness in past. His son is asthmatic and his father had skin allergy. The patient was a chronic smoker for the last 15 years, chronic tobacco chewer from the age of 14 years and taking <coughs> regularly alcohol. On examination, he was found to have bilateral nasal polyposis with mucoprolin discharge in the right nose. Already patient had lost his vision from the right eye with no process of light or finger movements while presented to us. And the investigations done were hemogram, Initially, t, uh, total count and neutrophil cell counts was elevated. Subsequently, it came to normal level. Uh, LFT was done. It was within normal limits except elevated liver and jack, which also came down to normal after medical therapy. Renal function test was normal. Thyroid function test was normal. Blood sugar was normal. Cultural sensitivity for nasal discharge was advised, but somehow it, uh, report is not available. The weight ticket. Other investigation uh, chest x ray shows bilateral increased bronchovascular markings. X ray PNS shows haziness in right maxillary sinus. CT scan PNS in orbit was taken and it shows right pan sinusitis and polyposis and left maxillary, eth maxillary eth uh, ethmoid with features of orbital cellul cellulitis and periorbital abscess. MRI orbit was taken uh, done and it was uh, report was suggestive of marked right-sided orbital cellulitis with proptosis. MRI brain was done. It was advised neurologist advised by neurologist and it was found within normal limit. So a final diagnosis of allergic rhinosinusitis with bilateral nasal polyposis, polyposis with orbital cellulitis with blindness in right eye was made. And the management given was initially broad spectrum antibiotic. Uh, it included Tazek, Gentamycin, Metrogel, Linezolid, Augmentin. Then uh, uh, ophthalmologist suggested Tobramycin eye drops, Moxifloxacin, Dimox, Potclor syrup, and Timolone. Then uh, from ENT side, he was advised Levocetrazine, Noxy spray, Saline nasal dosing, and Anaractin. And subsequently, he was operated on 23rd, uh, 21st of March with bilateral phase with polypectomy with orbital decompression under TA. And then follow up is going on. This is the first picture when we came across the patient. Clear cut swelling around the orbit. Then uh, here we can, we can see the mucoprolin discharge coming out from the